was kind of interested in reading this one because people often read about stories talking about how drones they're apparently spying on people although for the most part most people don't do that they just capture things like scenery so this one here it says harry and megan sue over drone photos of son archie a complaint filed in Los Angeles, California on Thursday claims an unmanned individual photographed 14-month-old Archie at the Sussex home during the coronavirus lockdown. The royal couples have claimed the pictures were an invasion of privacy. The lawsuit highlights privacy laws in California. The couple's lawyer, Michael Kump, said every individual and family member in California is guaranteed by law the right to privacy in their home. No drones, helicopters, or telephoto lenses can take away that right. So to my understanding with this lawsuit, what they're doing is even though they don't know who the person is, they're basically putting something out there where if anyone publishes any photos in relations to I guess their son in that way, then they will be sued. So it's kind of like blocking them from doing it. But it's kind of interesting even reading here like they say things like no drone or telephoto lens or whatever. And then plus they're saying since I guess they're high profile obviously, even people are using things like helicopters. This is kind of my example actually when it comes to regulation and stuff like that, you don't need all those redundant over the top laws. If that's your reason, for example, if you're scaring people say, oh, we need to keep them away from people because of their privacy. Like here, look at all this different stuff that people can and do use. You don't have necessarily an individual law for each piece of equipment and tech. It's a general thing. If you're doing something like say voyeurism or whatever, then they will be punished for it, correct? I guess in terms of capturing things like photos and I guess data with drones, this was kind of interesting because as you guys know, a lot of people around the world, especially law enforcement, are using drones more and people are worried about what do they do with the data? Kind of like that story with the naked beach one. This one says, Wilmington Police Department puts protest permits, bike registration, and drone records online. It says free. Calling the need to increase transparency and convenience for the public, the Wilmington Police Department has made several updates to its website. While WPD didn't explicitly put the updates in context of a recent protest downtown, they do all appear related. The first update is a new permits and foreign tabs, which includes online access to three forms, intent to picket, bike registration, and noise permits. WPD has also added a link to an online drone log, which outlines when and why drones were used in the month of June. According to the department, the page will be updated monthly, allowing citizens to track how police are utilizing these drones moving forward, according to WPD. So that's kind of interesting, making your whole drone logs and stuff public, I guess, to show people this is what we're using it for. Because again, a lot of people are afraid they'll be using it, I guess, in a bad way. Makes you wonder if this is going to be like a standard too, where people like police departments have to publish all their log records and stuff publicly.
right, see you guys later.